Hey folks, how's it going? Doing something a little bit new on the channel. Going to do a little bit of game hunting. Normally do a lot of sports card content, but we're going to go out and do some small town video game hunting and see what we can find. But don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, if you're new to the channel, definitely appreciate the support. But yeah, let's go find some games. I normally don't have a lot of luck at that Goodwill. There's a lot of competition there, but a new donation looked like it had just come out. I ended up picking up a complete copy of Lost, Ratchet and Clank, Tools of Destruction, uh, game and case only. And then probably the best pickup was the Shadow of the Colossus collection. All three of those, $4 a piece, $12 for everything. Not a bad stop. A couple nice finds at that Goodwill. Picked up a copy of Heroes Over Europe, and Battle Stations Midway, their games were two dollars a piece, so four dollars for the pair. Not too bad. Ended up with some really good games from those two pawn shops. First stop was at Money and More. They've got a $3 rack, so I picked up four games off of there. Uh, we had Last of Us on PS3, Little Big Planet, Complete Copy of Shadowrun, and then uh, Hunted Demon Forge, $12. It was the 20% off day as well, so getting all four of those for about $20 was a pretty solid deal. And then at Easy Pawn, even better deal, $3 a piece on each of these. Uh, we had Minecraft, that's a reproduction uh, cover, so basically disc only there. Naruto, Ultimate Ninja Storm, uh, case and disc. Complete copy of World at War. Complete copy of Black Ops. And then to round out the uh, 3 for 15 deal, we got a copy of Motorstorm. Not too bad, couldn't be happier with those pickups from uh, a couple pawn shops. Unfortunately, no luck of that stuff, etc. Just a lot of overpriced sports titles and some Wii shovelware. Let's head to the next stop. What a crazy find at that video games, etc. Was able to pick up a really nice copy of Bullet Witch on Xbox 360 for just about $35. Uh, case, manual, game looked really clean. If you ever find this with the poster as well, it's over a $100 game.
ended up being a really successful trip to trinkets thought it was pretty cool to find a switch accessory uh this is going to be just a game holder i thought it was pretty cool with the uh, game and watch front but for a dollar couldn't uh couldn't pick that up fast enough and then really surprised to see some ps1 games uh picked up final fantasy 9 black label it's got the manual in there all the discs look good really solid deal for that one a green label copy of Legend Dragoon. Dragoon. Legend of Dragoon. A greatest hits copy of Legend of Dragoon. All four discs in here looked really good. No manual, unfortunately, but this is going to be one that I hold on to. I remember playing through this as a kid. And then also a pretty nice copy of Red Dead Revolver. Gonna need to get a replacement case, but the manual's in there. Game looked nice. Overall, that's a pretty good win. I probably could have picked up the Mortal Kombat games as well, but those were just gonna be uh, case and game. No manual in there. The box art looked a little ragged, so not quite a good deal, but $16 for that whole stack was pretty solid. It ended up being an awesome day. I didn't expect to pick up a couple great RPGs on the PS1, and also finding Bullet, which was a really pleasant surprise. Paying a little over $30 for that was a great deal. Normally, I don't have this much luck at this many different locations, but I was really pleasantly surprised with the selection of PlayStation 3 games I was able to find. And a very nice copy of Red Dead Revolver. Overall, I ended up spending $100, and based on eBay comps, I came away with about $340 worth of games. Of course, some of those are going to go into the personal collection, and some of those are going to get sold to make my money back. This ended up being a pretty fun video to make, and a little something different for the channel. Make sure to let me know in the comments if you enjoyed this one. And while you're at it, make sure you go ahead and like and subscribe. The support for the channel is always appreciated. Good luck to all you folks going out and hunting for games, and I hope you have a great rest of your day.